Hi everyone. Today our topic is how to use concurrency concurrency thread group in Apache G meter tool. This is only our topic today. The mainly how you need to get the uh, the concurrency thread group. Okay, you are the latestly you need to download at the JMeter tool. Na. You not able to get the uh, concurrency thread group. That time you need to add the plugins. Okay, there is a plugin name called you can directly update it to the first uh, go to JMeter plugin manager okay after select the select the custom select the custom thread group and upgrade it upgraded means uh, e, uh, j meter only automatically Download it. Okay. That purpose you can use the JMeter. Uh, the thread name is custom thread group. Plugin name. Custom thread group. Okay. This one. Once you can select and you can click on upgrade now, otherwise download. Automatically uh, JMeter only will download it. Just you can connect your internet. Okay, all the plugins will be downloaded and installed. It's not required restart also. Now latest version Jupyter 5.4 automatically will came. Maybe any issue, it's not able to came. Just you can one time you can restart. Otherwise you can just close and reopen. It is enough. It's everything will be applied. Okay, now I need to show the demo how to use the uh, concurrency thread group in real time. Oh, what is the main purpose you need to how we need to design okay that purpose i will explain i will use the demo application demo application url i am generally using jpet store only okay jpet store application i will use it and uh, uh, jmeter test plan jmeter test plan First, I will use the test plan. It's uh, by by default available. This one, this element. After blaze meter concurrency. Okay, blaze meter concurrency thread group. Okay, place meter concurrency thread group. After I will use the HTTP request. After view result string, view result string, and aggregate report. Aggregate report. Okay, these are the general elements I used for today. Demo I will show you how you need to use okay for concurrency thread group and you need to remember one point first of all you need to learn to the if for any element what is how you need to use and what is the situation you use it to the the specific element and what is the use that one okay these are the minimum common things you need to learn first i will go to directly in google i will ask What is the use of concurrency concurrency thread group in Apache J meter tool? Okay, 
you need to learn this way step by step exactly uh, that uh, specific thread group what is the use okay you need to learn example it is intended to maintain the level of concurrency which means starting additional during the runtime threads if there is not enough of the uh, running in parallel unlike standard thread group it's not create all threads of friend so extra memory will not be used okay there is a common uh, standard thread group thread group means it's a thread group only the thread group it's not possible you need to perform or uh, your specific requirement anything it's not uh, requirement is not meet that time you need to use the concurrency thread group okay concurrency thread group used to uh, you will fulfill the your requirement and you never uh, capture to or uh, you, you never use it to the any extra memory also okay that is the main purpose and you need to directly go to the in jmeter tool i will open my jmeter it's a e folder you can go to jmeter you need to open okay this is my jmeter first of all how you need to add the your concurrency thread group plugin that time what you need to do first of all you can go to the options there is a plugin manager option otherwise there is a this place also plugin manager option you can just click on okay these are all the i am already installed okay now you need to see this one custom thread groups okay this custom thread groups this plugin you installed it's available installed plugin you not installed it go to the available plugin it's available just you need to click on that is enough and you need to drag down this one there is a <coughs> apply changes and restart jmeter example this custom thread group <coughs> plugin is available now available plugin just <coughs> just click on that one and once you need to click on it's a just apply changes and restart jmeter you can press automatically it's downloaded and and you will restart the jmeter okay that way you need to download the this one specifically custom thread group once custom thread group is installed and restart will be done after you can go to the test plan go to add go to thread go to thread group you can see now it's available blaze meter thread groups means arrival thread group concurrency free form arrival thread group stepping thread group ultimate thread group setup thread group t down thread group this all the things will be came to plugin manager only will provide otherwise only thread group only will be came now i need to add the blaze meter concurrency thread group okay after i will add the sampler http request go to listener view results tree after another you can take the aggregate report okay and my application is general one i will take the jpet store only okay go to enter the store i will take this url
okay it's a uh, ready for this one you need to ready for the testing and uh, view results tree everything it's uh, showing to the that you want is each and every request pass or fail aggregate report will provide the all the details generally now you need to decide and design you need to observe first of all it's a blaze meter concurrency thread group and the name is blaze meter concurrency thread group you can give any name and comments also you need to provide action to be taken after a sampler error a sampler error one is continue one is continue means once you need to start the test automatically will start it otherwise start next thread loop you have multiple threads and you need to click on start now that time start next thread loop now <coughs> not first one second one will be started stop thread you know everyone just will be stopped stop test the difference is stop thread means users will be stopped test means entire test will be stopped okay that is gradually you need to stop or suddenly you need to shut down that one okay stop test now means it is suddenly all threads will be stopped otherwise current the specific thread um, thread group only will stop at this point of view after target concurrency target concurrency means it's a threads threads means users how many users example i will give the just 10 users only it's a demo purpose after ramp up time i will give only 5 minutes time okay it's a minutes 5 minutes ramp up steps count i need 10 okay hold target rate time in minutes it's a hold also 10 minutes i need okay means every 30 seconds one user will be ramp up total duration will be take total 15 minutes 5 minutes ramp up and uh, 10 minutes will be holding but uh, based on the clients guys okay some clients will be taken the only duration only throughput will be taken hits or throughput or anything will be taken only duration time only no ramp up no ramp down only duration only will be taken okay okay it's a very strictly will be taken only duration only but some clients some clients means that people also it's already performance architects or some other higher level performance side you know very full knowledge everything end to end you know technical side but that people will be taken ramp up duration ramp up total time only will be taken to the throughput also will be taken i will face uh, different different clients different different way will be taken but your side you need to provide the the total duration example uh, you need to run 15 minutes duration you need to give the this is 5 minutes this is 10 minutes this total time is the your execution time okay client how we need to take in that is different way okay is anything required only duration yeah that time you need to design that way but uh, client did not provide anything you can take into the end time time is your execution time that's all okay okay every client will be taken um, uh, the way of thinking is different the people will be taken different but originally the total time is the execution time that's all okay after time units it's a minutes level you need a seconds level you need this one okay i need only minutes only i will select only minutes only thread iteration limit it's only 10 users around um, 15 minutes will be running okay i will give minimum maybe just request only na you will take in thousand thousand iteration limit it's no problem log thread status in file okay i will take in i will provide the location concurrency dot 
csv okay you need to save this file concurrency thread okay i will give the name just to click on save okay it's only 15 minutes only you need to see how you need to the test will be executed okay you can i'm already provided all the details you are ready to start you can see the first one user will be launched now every 30 seconds every 30 seconds another user will be launched total 10 users <coughs> 5 minutes duration every 1 minute 2 users will be login you can see 18 19 20 remaining you can see it's a one user only once the 30 will be came now you can say another user will be login 30 okay second user will be launched now this way one by one will be added and total duration also 10 minutes will be came and he will down this is the way guys you need to design to the concurrency thread group but one more important point this is for just demo purpose i created but your original test side you need to create the multiple concurrency thread groups and view results tree aggregate reports tree, all the things will be created okay that time what you need to do now uh, you need any matrix anything you can provide the path okay file path you need to provide it to the csv files okay aggregate report also you need to provide the same csv file path location provided this all the things uh, elements it's a memory consumption that reason you need to disable this one okay otherwise best practice go to directly non gv mode only you need to run your execution that is the best way okay any new people see so don't know that much level okay you can use but there is also it's a limited users only remember this point gui mode it's a main thing is you need to debug you need to prepare the script that's all your job is over execution everything non gui mode but it's a simple users simple means it's a 100 200 <coughs> based on your capacity thousand users also okay thousand users also uh, based on your system configuration it's able to perform okay it's a thousand will be crossed it's not able to run that is system capacity guys the system capacity low the 500 users also will be able to get the out of memory errors okay it's not perform based on your system capacities you need to execute your test successfully and complete it but the most preference is non-j mode only execution you can set up your test data uh, multiple missions same location and you need to run the test that's all okay it's a very simple only it's not that much of high complex okay uh, two minutes already done just you can wait remaining some time okay it's a view results tree you know everyone this one okay every request will be pass or fail will be showing that is only this work okay not only this one there are so many elements but mostly using this one aggregate report will provide the it's a very one request only it's not more than it's a label each <coughs> request will provide samples means uh, samples means it's a request or transactions your side you need to provide this one average response time median 90 percent line 95 99 you need to see this is the some uh, very important most of the people will take a 95 will be taken what is this one 90 95 99 means out of 100 percent of transactions 90 percent line means 90 percent of request is response is good remaining 10 percent is high 95 means 95 percent response is good just remaining 5 percent only high response time 99 means 99 is best response but 1 percent is high response but most of the clients will prefer to the 95 percent line only will prefer this one minimum maximum you know everyone you can see minimum is 0 0.9 seconds 
it's a milliseconds guys jmeter will provide milliseconds maximum 21,699 means 1000 means 1000 milliseconds one second that is in 21 seconds it's a very high level error percentage 0 0.07 this is a demo application that is sometime will fail also throughput is as a tps okay throughput side there are three variations one is tps transaction per second tpm transaction per minute tph transaction per hour okay based on uh, your way of execution how the long duration that based only this one will be divided sent to received it's a network side okay he will provide it it's i will provide at petstore.octopref.com it's a, some additional link will be provided okay this is the application guys uh, sorry this is the element you need to design this one okay based on what is your requirement your requirement side you need to design your uh, entire test and you need to execute and you need to fulfill your request what are the jmeter elements will provided everything is your requirement fulfillment purpose only will create it okay and you need to learn this request how we need to use what is the purpose uh, what is the compared to remaining thread uh, thread groups what is the difference one okay how to resolve these issues and each and every element what purpose will be used how it work you know that knowledge everything na? these elements any one time uh, your career will be used okay just learning purpose only i created this video okay i am already used this thread group also that is no level explain you also try uh, your requirement side you need to try this one otherwise it's a it's a general standard thread group only it is enough yeah you can use that one also no problem okay now time is totally six six minutes done you can see total 10 users will be now is running and you can go to the it's a location you can see there is a concurrency uh, csv file also is already generated once the test is completed now i will open and i will show you just you can wait remaining remaining minutes will once completed now i will show you and beyond practice guys you can practice one or two times minimum 10 times also you need to practice also is a very good okay you have more practice you can easily you able to do any type of work and successfully okay you did not practice that time you have faced many problems and you need to learn to the uh, performance uh, testing or engineering or clouds or devops anything you need to learn fully and you need to work independently without dependent to anyone for anyone you are never dependent you need to learn independently you need to work and you can learn to the all the things nowadays the requirement will became as a performance test engineer in current companies in india not for outside countries only india the requirement will be came around 10 years experienced peoples in need performance testing tools end to end performance engineering tools end to end the same time performance clouds clouds means aws azure gcp this all the things you need to install and configure and you need to use okay after testing engineering clouds and build and deployment also and means devops also you need to learn the devops pipeline will be created means uh, build and release na, there is the pipeline will be created that all work you only do and functional testing is a mandatory nowadays is asking okay functional testing is a mandatory and automation mandatory you need to learn minimum selenium with java 
okay this is also very 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 useful okay and the minimum languages as per the it's my knowledge south indian telugu it's our mother tongue you need to directly you can talk but most of the peoples will looking for in india hindi will be key that reason you need to learn hindi language also and english generally it's a business language you must and should in the yeah, english you need to learn these three languages okay you able to happily you need to work to your company okay that's all guys this one okay nowadays the market keep on changing and uh, companies also expecting it's a more and more the reason the way of people is asking for uh, high level packages that reason only companies also will be taken that one but the multiple resources work only you want to do and you never take any bench time that type of things is not there you did not have any performance project must and should you need to moving to the automation or functional or performance engineering or performance clouds or build and release pipeline you can moving immediately okay you have multiple skills yeah you need to move for any one i need to work okay you know everyone company mentality how we need to teach trade to the employees okay you need to interestly you need to learn your skills and update your skills that time only you able to survive to the any company okay okay it's over that one and guys remaining just 4 minutes please you need to wait the test is completed it's a keep on running only yeah still is moving and uh, error percentage just 0.04 it's a something uh, one or two request is failed it's a demo application only it's not original one and one more important point this is only application okay jpet store you also go and check the internet and get it and report preparation it's a very important big task okay report preparation you must and should learn okay or the mails and excel report in performance performance tests most using uh, excel sheet only excel sheet only multiple sheets you need to create and prepare your test and write the all the details that one only that reason you need to learn excel word powerpoint okay that minimum Uh, ms office tools you need to learn all the features you need to learn how you need to use example something excel sheet or word document you need to attach it to your excel sheet you need to insert the object okay how you need to insert that one that that are the simple things also the people you don't know okay that is only i will explain this all the things you need to learn all features you use or you do not use that is secondary first of all you know that all the details that time only you able to easily need to create the beautiful reports and represent it to the clients or marketing team or management team there are so many people will came to the in performance testing way and you are the single person you need to handle a technical side and the management side okay be aware all the details you need to learn okay keep on learning only there is no other chance okay remaining 2 minutes we'll done our test just 2 minutes you will done the test please be wait
yeah remaining just uh, 20 seconds guys will be done the test a total ram down only Yeah, it's a completed the test. Now you need to go to the. This is the file, CSV file. Okay, you can see it's a status only will provided. Okay. You don't have any values that is only will came zeros otherwise you will provide the all the details okay anything will be fail me you will show that one that it's a log file guys you need to remember this is a log file it's a wrap up time and ram time only will provided the concurrency will provide this locations but there is no any failure no it did not show anything otherwise you will show that one okay yeah that's all guys this video this is only mainly you can how you need to use to the that concurrency thread group that purpose only i created okay and the remaining also i will explain after remaining means uh, you can go to the this one blaze uh, arrival thread group concurrency, uh, concurrency thread group now i will show you free form arrival thread group stepping thread group ultimate thread group setup thread group take down thread group and general thread group also i will show you next my videos this all the list i will show you okay uh, that's all guys this video i will connect to the my next video thank you very much for everyone bye, bye.